friends in previous class already discussed middle term of the binomial expansion x plus a whole power n x plus a whole power n here n is a even the middle term is a t n plus 1 by 2 t n by 2 plus 1 now in this expansion n is a odd in the middle terms is a two middle terms is there what that means n plus 1 by 2 and t n plus 3 by 2 yes in this one already explained in the previous class the expansion of the x plus a in whole power n n is even and equal is having a one middle term n is a odd means having a two middle terms the two middle terms is a t n plus 1 by 2 and t n plus 3 by 2 now today we will discuss about the topic numerically greatest term in the binomial expansion numerically greatest term in the binomial expansion now you know that the standard form of the binomial expansion 1 plus x whole power n means nc0 plus nc1 x plus nc2 h square plus and so on ncn x power n this is a standard form of the binomial expansion already discussed in the last class that one 1 plus x a whole power n now how to find the numerical greatest term in the binomial expansion of the 1 plus x whole power n now we are having the one of the formula what is the formula means ngt numerical greatest term is equal to n plus 1 into modulus of x by 1 plus modulus of x 1 plus modulus of x now for example i am taking this value is equal to p it's become that value is equal to p now x become that value is equal to p means p as an integer p as an integer now in the binomial expansion having the two ngt terms means two numerical greatest terms that is a t p and p p plus one means now here observe on that one now numerical greatest term of the expansion of the 1 plus x whole power n is having a formula n plus 1 into modulus of x by 1 plus modulus of x for example x become that answer is a p p is an integer now is having how many are the ngt terms means tp and tp plus 1 now in this one is having a p plus f means here f means 0 less than f less than 1 now in this time that expansion is having only one term what is the problem is tp plus 1 in that one we are having the that is only one term tp plus 1 i will see is the listen numerically greatest term in the binomial expansion of the 1 plus x whole power n is equal to n plus 1 modulus of x by 1 plus modulus of x it's become a, for example, I am taking letters that is a value is a p. p is an integer, is a having a two integer terms. Now, is a, that formation has become a p plus f, means it's forming a dimension. Formation means a zero uh, less than f, less than one. Uh, in that time, is a having a only one NGT term that is a tp plus one. Now, we will discuss uh, the topic uh, is the end of the one example. Now let, let us observe that one now. Find the NGT in the expansion of the 3 plus 2x whole power 15 when x is equal to 5 by 2. Now 3 plus 2x whole power 15 that is equal to I am taking 3 is a common 3 into 1 plus 2x by 3 whole power 15. Now since uh, a b whole power m is equal to a power m into b power m. Now apply that condition 3 power 15 into 1 plus 2x by 3 whole power 15. Now 1 plus 2x by 3 whole power 15 with comparing 1 plus x whole power n. Now here n is equal to 15. Now I am taking here capital X is equal to 2x by 3. 2x by 3. Now, finding that one value, n plus 1 into modulus of x by 1 plus modulus of x, that is equal to n means 15 plus 1 plus modulus of x means 2x by 3 by 1 plus modulus of 2x by 3, 
that is equal to 16 into modulus of 2 by 3 into x value replace means what is it one 5 by 2 by 1 plus 2 into 2 by 3 into 5 by 2 now that is equal to here 2 is get cancelled 16 into 5 by 3 by 2 to get cancelled 1 plus 5 by 3 that is equal to 80 by 3 here taking the LCM 8 by 3 now write reciprocals 80 by 3 into 3 by 8 now 8 1 ja, 8 10 ja. means 10 means integer that is called a yeah, integer now according to situation any term now here p is integer now how many terms is he having in that expansion means 2 terms is there what is the 2 terms of the any terms means t10 and t10 plus 1 are ng terms in this expansion t10 and t10 plus 1 are ng terms numerical greatest terms now how to find the t10 you know that tr plus 1 is equal to ncr into x power n minus r into a power r is if you want a t10 is equal to t9 plus 1 that is equal to n means already is given how much is there 15 c9 here x means according to taking that one now 3 power 15 minus 9 and a means 2x 1 power 15 now that is equal to 15 c9 3 power 6 2 into now replace by x value 5 by 2 1 power 15 now 2 to get cancel 15 c9 3 power 6 5 power 15 that is one of the NGT in the expansion of the 3 plus 2x 1 power 15 now similarly now t11 is equal to t10 plus 1 that is equal to 15 c10 plus 3 power 15 minus 10 into 5 power 10 now that is equal to 15 c power 10 3 power 5 into 5 power 10 now In the terms uh, in the expansion of the 3 plus 2x plus 4 power 15 is uh, t10 and t11. Now let me explain this concept uh, with the help of the another example. Means what that means uh, find the NJT term uh, in the 2x minus 3 by 1 power 15 uh, when uh, h is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3 by 2. Now 2x minus 3y 1 power 15. Now I'm taking is a 2x is a common. 1 minus 3y by 2x whole power 15. Now, by applying that formula, a b whole power m is equal to a power m into b power m that is equal to 2x whole power 12 into 1 minus 3y by 2x whole power 12. Now, 1 minus 3y by 2x whole power 12 by comparing 1 plus x whole power n. Now, n means here 12 and uh, x is equal to minus 3y by 2x minus 3y by 2x now here I will find in the modulus of the x means modulus of x at uh, x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3 by 2 means modulus of minus 3 into 3 by 2 by 2 into 1 that is equal to minus 9 by 2 by 2 that is equal to minus 9 by 4 is the remote modulus 9 by 4 9 by 4. Now, finding uh, n plus 1 into modulus of x by 1 plus modulus of x that is equal to is replaced by the value so 12 plus 1 into modulus of x by well already defined 9 by 4 by 1 plus 9 by 4 that is equal to 13 into 9 by 4 by is it take it LCM 13 by 4 13 by 4 now 
13 into 9 by 4 into right reciprocal so 4 by 13. Now 13 is that is get cancelled and 4 4 also get cancelled. It's become here 9. It's become here 9. 9 also is that is a integer. That is called also is a integer. Now 9 is the integer means you know that one of the formula. What does it mean? Sir? Tp and Tp plus 1. Means here observing what is the root means sir? Tp means sir, T9 and T9 plus 1 are ng terms. Are ng terms. Okay. Now you observe this one now. You look at the standard form of the 1 plus x whole power n is equal to nc0 plus nc1 x plus nc2 h square plus and so on ncn x power n. Now finding the numerical greatest term in the binomial expansion of the 1 plus x whole power n is that is having the one of the formula what it means ngt is equal to n plus 1 into minus of xy 1 plus minus of x. Now here p now um, let us this taking value is a p. Now p is an integer in this expense is having a two terms that is a tp and a tp plus 1. Now is a p is a forming a p plus f. Means uh, is a decimal form is having means the, what is that means uh, in the numerical in the numerical greatest term is a tp plus 1. tp plus 1. Now observing uh, how to find the ng term in the expansion of the 3 plus 2 x whole power 15 by x is equal to 5 by 2. Now using the process. Now taking the first of all is the constant terms. Now right uh, with the comparing 1 plus x whole power n. After now using that formula. Now that formula now using means become a 10. 10 is called a integer. Now integer means forming a 2 terms. What is the term means? T ten and T ten plus 1 are called a NGT terms. Now you know the general formula. And the binomial expansion of x plus a 1 power n dr plus 1 is equal to ncr into x power n minus r into a power r. Now apply that condition. Now it's become that one only. Now 2x plus 1 power 9 into 2 into 5. It right means 15 c9 into 3 power 6 into 5 power 9. Now also t power 9 as usual. Now I am discussing about the another example also. What does it mean? Find how to find the NGT term in the expression of the 2x minus 3y whole power 12 when x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 3 by 2. Now using the process only. Okay. Thank you. Tomorrow I will discuss another topic.